it's wrinkle head, wrinkle head, wrinkle head, wrinkle head, wrinkle head, wrinkle head. He's wrinkle head. He's all wrinkled. Wrinkle head is a wrinkle dude. He's all wrinkled by a wrinkle piece of paper. Paste all over, adventure all day. Never stop the fun, all guarantee. Wrinkle head, wrinkle head, wrinkle head. Wrinkle head, wrinkle head, wrinkle head. He's clumsy and clumsy and falls all day. But that's what makes him wrinkle head. Yeah, that's what makes him wrinkle head. Dun 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 dun. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Case is gonna be very, very, very hard to zip up. Here, allow me to give you a hand. Zip! Wow! <laughs> I can tell, Daylu, that you got that flexible strength inside your muscle. Well, we go ahead when you're working out for a girl like me. You gotta get that strength on. You gotta have a strength like this. I wish I could unsee that. <laughs> Come on, you guys. We gotta make sure we're all packed up and ready to go. What about you, Frostis? Are you all packed up and ready to go? Of course I am, sis. I got everything I need right here. Your cell phone? Yep, that's all I'm taking. You better take you some clothes just in case. What? Changing clothes? I don't need clothes. I'm wearing the same clothes I got on. But you never know. We might be staying overnight. Overnight? No, this is going to be a one whole day thing. I don't need any changing clothes. Well, you never know, sweetie. You might want to peg you some up just in case. Come on, Mom. Don't give Daisel any ideas. She'll start pressuring me for it. Yeah, brother. That's why I said get some changing clothes. <laughs> Fine. I'll get one pair of underwear. That's probably all I need. One pair of underwear. Are you kidding? All right, kids. Let's head inside the car. Come on. I can't wait. A weekend in a hotel? Here we come. Yep, a weekend in a hotel. All right. Wait, did you say a weekend? Yeah, didn't we just tell you that? I thought you said we were going to be there for a day. Why do you think I said bring you some enough changing clothes? Well, now I'm definitely going to give me enough changing clothes because we're going to be there for a whole weekend and I only got one pair of underwear. Man, didn't we just tell you to get you out? You know what? I'll be right back. Didn't we just tell him? Right. Didn't we just tell him that? Right. Man, I thought y'all said for a whole day. Y'all talking about some whole weekend. Now I got to give me extra clothes. Hey, you never know. You, you never know how long we're going to be somewhere. That's why you must always be ready. Fine. I got me enough clothes already. There are two pairs of socks, two pairs of underwear, two pairs of t-shirts. I'm ready. I hope you got enough. I got enough. All right. Are you sure you're ready? Yes, I'm ready. All right, then. Let's go, kids. Yay! Hotel, here we come. <laughs> so, do 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 do. No, 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 no. <sighs> I can't wait to get there. There's going to be everything. There's going to be a pool and a jacuzzi. Well, isn't a pool like a jacuzzi, but it's different. Um, uh, I can see where you're going with there, Mom. I can see where you're going there. And there's lots of free food. Ooh, free food. As long as we pay to get in. We don't got to pay for the food? Yep, we just got to pay to get inside. And everything else is free. All right, we just got to pay to get in. Thank goodness we've been saving enough. Hey, we've been saving enough for a whole summer to actually miss out on something like this. Right, we wouldn't want to miss out on anything special like this. Uh, exactly. What's that noise? Um, it sounds like the motor. <gasps> Uh-oh. Mom, what's wrong with our car? I don't know, Diesel. It ain't supposed to sound like that. Actually, I think maybe it is trying to sound like that. Maybe it's trying to function better. Wrinkle head for crying out loud. It's a car shutting down. Don't you know what happens when a car shuts down? It means we need to put more gasoline in it. No, it's had enough fuel. It means there's something wrong with the engine inside the tank. Bam! Hang on, kids! Wow! Whoa! Ow! Here I come! We need to stop! Let's stop! Oh, I hit the table! Big! Oh, I hit the screen! I hit the window! All right. 
I might as well pop up the hood and see what's messing with our motor. <laughs> oh, pop, oh, that pop scared me. Oh, <laughs> bam! Wait, don't airbags usually deploy when they're going bad with the cars? <gasps> Duck! <laughs> Boom! Airbag has been deployed. <laughs> What was that? I wasn't planning to start my road trip like this. Don't worry, kids. I'll find out what the problem is. I'll see what is wrong with this silly old car. What? Someone had to make the trumpet noise. Just as I feared. Oh, man, look at this mess. The motor is all tied up and tangled. What? How did it get tangled? I don't know. It must have been from a... What's that noise? A squirrel? How did a squirrel get in there? Man, get out of here, you little furry head. Trying to chew up our motor. Who do you think you is? How would you get in there? What are we going to do now, Mom? I'm sorry, sweetie, but it's going to take a minute to fix this. Oh, you mean we have to wait until it's fixed? But what about the motel? The motel will have to wait. We got to get this fixed. If we don't get this fixed, we're not going to have nothing to ride to the motel. Oh. Don't worry. I'll see what I can do. Why don't you kids go play in the woods until I'm finished and see what's going on? All right. Come on, guys. All right. Oh, we're gonna miss out on everything! And it's all that stupid car's fault! It's not the car's fault, wrinkled head. Well, it was the squirrel's fault, but really, it was the car's fault for the motor. It's the motor's fault. It's the one I got tangled because of the squirrel. No, I really don't wanna... It was the squirrel, right? Why are you not saying it was the squirrel? Okay, fine, it was the squirrel. I just didn't wanna blame nothing on that innocent little squirrel. You just called him a furry little head. That was mean. You're right, so I'm technically mad at him, so forget you, squirrel. I'm leaving, man. Get out of here. You chewed up our motor. We don't want to see you. Oh, guys, we got to do something to get our mind off the hotel until the car gets fixed. Well, don't you worry about that, Dazel. Why don't we go for a little hike in the woods, the deep, dark woods? There might be a buffalo in there. <sighs> don't worry, brother. We're going to walk together. And if we need any help, Mom will be right there fixing the car. Oh, Let's try and walk before we start losing our minds because I feel like that car is never going to get fixed. Never going to get... Uh, forget I said that. It's going to get fixed. Uh, I don't think so. I heard that. Aww. We're going to die out here, guys. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo. It's been two hours since our car broke down. And still... No sign of hope. Uh, I think I'm going to pass out. You and I both, buddy. You and I both. And yet, no survivors. I need some water. Water. Quick, guys. Think positive for water. Um, uh, I know. Maybe you can try pretending that our saliva is water. Ugh, I'm not going to drink my own saliva. Hey, it's water. Yeah, but it's mouth water. Ugh! Now you know how I feel. Man, it's useless. This car is never going to get fixed. I'm going to have to go out and buy me a new one. With all my money that I saved for our vacation hotel? Aw, oh, man, no! We better go back and see how Mom is doing. All right. Mom, please tell me. I'm sorry, kids. Oh, no, Mom, before you say that, don't make me lose my hope. Yeah, I don't want to lose my hope either. Neither do I. Well, I'm sorry, kids, but you might as well lose your hope because I didn't get it fixed. Ah! Ah! I knew it. You couldn't fix it. Well, it's too hot to do anything. It's overheated, and the gasoline is going out from all the hotness, and these tires are still not together. I don't think we're going to make it to the hotel today. No! No! Oh, man, why? It's not fair. You know what? I'm going to go find a... I'm going to go find a tree to kick. Be careful for splinters. 
Hey, ow! There's a splinter on my foot. I'll get it out for you. Does this hurt? Ow! <laughs> yeah, duh. I'm sorry, kids. I know you really wanted to go to the hotel today, but until we can get the car fixed, we gotta find ways to get around. How? We can walk? Wait. You wanna walk to the hotel? Sure! How do we try walking? But we've already went for a hike for walking, and boy, it's really hot. Well, it's worth the nothing. It's good exercise for our legs anyway. We can walk to the hotel. Come on, kids. Grab your suitcases and let's get walking. You guys feel like walking more? Oh, well, if we're going to the hotel and that's it, that's all we need to go. Unless we stop to get some water. Or maybe a few bites. Or maybe a few sunblock to keep our skin protected from the sun. I don't know. As long as we get to the hotel, I don't have no problem with that. Um, Ten minutes later. Uh, whew. I'm sweating like a mama boy. Whew. You and I both, Ma. I can't walk anymore. Uh, come on, buddy. I know you can walk another step. No, I can't. Uh, no, no, brother. Don't fall on us. Uh, I'm sorry, kids. I might need to sit on you. Whew. Mom! It's the closest thing I got to a chair. <sighs> Where's my GPS? Oh, that's right. I don't have a GPS. It was on the car, and we left the car. Oh... Uh, whew. You know, I don't remember being this far out. Gee, how can you tell, Mom? We're literally in the middle of a jungle. In the woods. And it's getting late! You're right, kids. It's gonna be dark time soon. By the time we get to the hotel, it's gonna be dark. Aww. We might need to camp outside for tonight. Outside?! Dun, 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 dun. See? We have everything we need. A cozy fire and each other. We'll make it to the hotel soon, kids. Don't worry. Um, Mom, I don't want to be a hoper that wants to give up on hope, but what if we never get to the hotel? Yeah, Mom, I got a grill with Wrinklehead. Yeah, me too. What if we don't ever get there? What do we do now? Well, it looks like we're going to have to go find someone to help us get our car fixed. I wish we could have did that all today if we were thinking, Hey, I know, sweetie. I didn't know you were going to go through a car damage. Aww. Hey, why don't we tell a story? That'll make us feel better, right? Okay. Why don't I tell a story? Once upon a time, there was a family of four. Hey, like us. We're a family of four. Exactly. <laughs> and they were trying to go somewhere very big. But then all of a sudden... They will realize that their car got broke down, and then they spent hours and hours and hours trying to find the repair shop, but it wasn't there, so they had to walk, walk, walk to find help, but there was no help around, and then they had to sit there all night and sleep in the stars with the mosquitoes by that night, and the sleeping bags keep us safe, and then they realized that they're never going to make it to the hotel at all, because they literally had all that hope of money, and then they wasted it all by never getting there. Wrinkle head, that sounds like what, we, what, what, we're, what we're literally going through right now. Right, that sounds like us. Right, that sounds like us. We were there when that happened, because that's what we're literally going through right now. You're right. <laughs> so, um, who wants to tell the next story? I think it's past our bedtime. Wait. We didn't even eat nothing. Oh, uh, we didn't eat nothing? You're right. Uh, it's so late. Uh, you kids feel like going to get us something to eat while I doze off? Wait, you're just going to go to sleep? Hey, I've been really hard working today. I had to literally go underneath a car. She's right, guys. You want to go and get something to eat? Why don't you two do that? I'm sleepy. Brother, it's not fair. We're in this together. Hey guys, I'm 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 upset right now. We don't have no food, no car, no hotel. We've literally lost everything. We're not gonna be survivors. We're goners. By the next morning, we're gonna be goners. That's not true. We'll find ways to survive out here until then. Yeah, well, uh, until now we're homeless. We don't even we can't even spend our money without having nowhere to spend our money at. We're homeless. 
you might as well just go find some bugs to eat and roast them up, because that's what we're going to eat tonight. Bugs? Ugh. Don't listen to him, Wrinklehead. We can find some fresh berries or something. Yeah, Dazel, we don't need no, no yucky bugs. Bugs need to survive. Come on, man, forget him. Yeah, forget him. We'll find something to eat. Yeah, good luck with that. I'm going to stay here with Mom keep her company. Dazel, are we ever going to find our car again and get back on the road? Don't worry, Wrinkled Head. Trust me. We'll get back on the road as soon as we can. But right now, we got to find something to eat. Well, okay, but... I don't know what's out here we can go for. Oh, man. Why is it always the wrinkle heads that has to go through the situation and not always the barrels? No, no, no. Maybe we could eat some of these rotten blueberries. I mean, they look all bitten up and eaten, but it doesn't look all that bad. Phew. Uh, Dazel? What was that you? If only I had a flashlight. <sighs> Something's coming from the woods. Let me get my stick ready. I'll be ready to whack it the heck to sleep. Do -do -do. Uh, that silly scary thing must have ran on and left. Wrinkled head! Diesel! What's wrong, buddy? Scary, creepy zombie! Run! Scram! Diesel! Wrinkled head! We gotta hide! We gotta get back to the others! Come on! Hurry! Step on it! Step on it! Go faster! Step on it! Go faster! Hurry, we're almost there! Almost there, almost there! Ah! Are you guys okay? What happened to the fool? We were being chased! Uh-oh! Please don't eat us! We're a family! I love my family! I know I've been so harsh to them, but I need them! Aw, they'll frost this! Ah! Oh, isn't that the squirrel who, who chewed up our motor? It is. Hi there, little buddy. What are you doing out here? Huh? What is he trying to tell us? You just want to say you're sorry for chewing up our motor? Oh, we forgive you. Yeah, a little bit. But you still chewed up our motor, and now we're homeless out here sleeping in the dark with the mosquitoes out. How do you plan to ex make our apology more exceptional? Right out. Right out. He wants us to follow him? Well, then we have to follow him. Let's follow away. Come on. Where are you taking us, little buddy? <laughs> Is that a car repair shop? We're saved! We're saved! We're gonna get our car fixed! Ah! We're gonna get our car fixed! Ah! You know what? 100% apology accepted, little buddy. Give me five. Ow. Thank you, little buddy. Ow. Hey there. Can I help you guys? Sir, please. We have a car that needs to be repaired. Give me a couple more hours and I'll be with y'all. Everything is going to turn out so much better, isn't it? It sure is. Thanks to that little squirrel, we got some help. Right on them. We'll always love you, little buddy. All right, guys, you're all set. Just try to keep it away from any sunlight as possible. You don't want to burn up more of the engines. Oh, and try not to let any more furry animals try to take over. Right on them. I don't think we'll ever have problems with that ever again. Well, kids, what do you say? You want to go to the hotel, or you guys want to go back home? You think we can still go to the hotel? Hotel, here we come. Yeah! All right. Um, so, how did you guys enjoy that night out? It was very scary. You know what? I was even that scared. Really? Not even the fact that you thought we were going to almost die out in the outdoors? Oh, I wasn't scared about that. Mm, sure you were, Frostus. Okay, fine, I was scared. I just didn't want you guys laughing at me. Well, 
it wasn't really funny, so why would we laugh? Oh, you're not gonna laugh at me because I was scared about us dying? Well, get news! We didn't die! <laughs> yeah, 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 we managed to survive, all thanks to that little squirrel. You know, I wonder what he's doing right now. Ooh, are those the berries that they tried to eat? I'm out of I do. All right, now that looks pretty, even better than the original. Toon Boon. Hi there, you guys love movies? So do I, because we have a cool, interesting movie tree from Toon Boon. A gang of friends loves eating paper with blank sheets. Uh, uh, uh. I like my paper scrambled. I like my paper roasted and toasted. I feel like everyone in this city is eating paper. Even we do. But when they create a donut, it escapes, and they must capture it. And who will eat it first? You guys can't eat me. I'm real. Oh my gosh, this donut is coming alive. Come back here. You can't catch me. You too slow. <laughs> oh, you spit at me? Don't miss the Toon Boom movie premiere of Paper Eaters. Premiere Saturday night at 7. Only on Toon Boon. That's a big difference. No, it's a, it's awesome. Doom to doom. Coming up next, it's Clockings. Show me what you got, player. Only on Toon Boon. Do you like Despicable Me? Do yeah, like but not candy? the third we'll one or the fourth one. Gru, the They're Minions. ruining build the franchise. Trap, pick your character, then collect your favorite Took candy them long enough to, to actually line. eat bananas. And why did they stop making these types of commercials? Hey, more Juicy Drop, and we just seen a commercial for Juicy Drop. That must have been a popular candy back then. With more sour gel. Great tasting flavor you can extend with gel. If she is the one who'll break the spell, you must finally learn to love. Rising in the heat, tell us all a story. Dolorolora, beauty and a beast. It passed June 6. We better move quickly. <gasps> she may be a bad headed one, but I like her. From the creator of Paper Eaters and Oink. Critics everywhere are craving for a guide. Get ready for the joyful, beautiful, smashing adventure for the whole family. Well, you're still my guider, right? I'll protect you. What's up? What's got the rabies on it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, no offense, little girl, but you gotta be nice and furious. Guide, now playing in 3D, rated PG. Oh man, I can't get my mind off Cuppy Mertz, the marshmallow cereal that you can't stand. Mm, maybe I better go see a doctor about it. Hello, Bloomin. Hi, Doc. I have a problem. I have a sugar addiction with Cuppy Merck. No matter what I do, I can't just leave that cereal alone. I see your problem. You can't get rid of Cuppy Merck, the marshmallowy cereal that's so you can't stand it. Just makes you want to go like, mm, mm, don't say that. It's, it's colorful. You know what? Mm, man, what is wrong with you? Man, I look. Man, you better sit down. <laughs> Cuppy Merck's is the marshmallowy cereal that you can't stand. All that marshmallowy taste. Mm. I'm looking at all of y'all. Cuppy Merck's cereal, part of a complete breakfast. Uh, you can't stand them. Mm. Diagnosis, sugar addiction. See, you got granola bars that's been half eaten, but still, you know, savory. Bang! On September 11th, the Dearlyings finally got their own movie. You guys don't probably even know who you really are. Uh, you guys said that we should just find out who we are? It was just a little solution. And the Ookaduka will be the Shmookaduka. Ah! It's hot. <gasps> what? I can't complain when something is hot, only you can burn your finger. J Turbs, Dearlyings. Theaters and Facebook September 11th rated PG. What's that sound? Oh. <laughs> What's that sound? What's that sound? Find the mystery noise. Ooh. A cow. We gotta find that sound. Man, where's that sound coming from? Mm, a whale. It's the mystery noise and the mystery noise. And a froggy. Oh, I'm about to say, I, I thought that was somebody else. <laughs> it's what's that sound? What's that sound? What's that sound? What's that sound game? Hear it and find it. Now available from Hamble. I got you now. 
synonym, I'm going on a treasure hunt to see what I can find. Ah, there's my target. Uh, B.O.'s. Delicious cinnamon cereal all raggly. Mmm. Oh. Kimmy! B.O. monkey. Ah, run! Give me my B.O.'s. You ain't kidding them. <gasps> Whoa! Delicious cinnamon B.O. cereal, part of a good breakfast. It's a B.O. Lolo, hey? New Nerf Nitro. Get ready for Nerf blasting power with cool foam cars made for speed and performance. Now you can pull off awesome stunts with no track at all. Go fast, fly high, turn any room into your stunt arena. There's only one way to power these stunts. Nerf Nitro. New Nerf Nitro. Each set sold separately.